Explain to us why you're having such a hard time balancing your personal life with all your other responsibilities. Well, I'm a full-time working mom. I work as a paralegal and an office manager four days a week. I volunteer at my son's preschool. I volunteer at my daughter's PTA. I also spend a lot of time as my daughter's Girl Scout leader. On top of that, I have a wedding and event planning business with my mom and sister, and I'm very busy with that on nights and weekends. Greg, okay, that, that's a lot. That's a lot. How can, what can she do to stop that? Well, look, I think the first thing you have to do is figure out who the priority relationship is in your life. And then from there, you can figure out, well, which of the other things can I deprioritize or jettison completely out of my life? Uh, but that's where it begins. Greg, you made a, a special house call to uh, Jacqueline's home to help her kind of create a plan that she can start prioritizing what's essential in her life. So let's see what happens. Okay, let's do this. Hi. Jacqueline, how are you? Great. Mm -hmm. Nice to meet you. Come on in. Thank you. I'd love to just kind of have a look at your life. This is your calendar here. This is my very full calendar. Okay. Tell me about some of the things you have going on. Um, well, we have Girl Scout meetings every other Friday. Um, I do have a date night scheduled, which was the first one in about three months. First one in three months. Yes. Okay, so I understand you've been busy with cookie season? I probably spend over 100 hours. How many dates have you had with your husband? During cookie season? Definitely zero. Zero. <laughs> and who's the priority relationship in your life? I want it to be my husband. What, for you, is something that is non-essential that you're over-investing in? I have an Etsy shop and a side business that I do oh. out of my garage. How much time are you spending on the Etsy business? A few hours a week. Non-essential. Right. And you're looking for More. a couple of hours yes. to be husband. able to spend time with your husband. You I see I see what you're doing there, <laughs> yes. So that's where you can make the trade-off. Right. And now we're gonna build the system so that you can actually make it happen. Wonderful. The first thing I want to talk about is just like a reward. Something that you get if you successfully make the trade-off. So what's a reward? It could be bigger or smaller or whatever, but it I just- I just want a weeknight off with my husband as a reward. The second thing we need is to establish an accountability partner. Who comes to mind for you? With That'll that? be my sister. What's something else that you think would encourage you, motivate you to do this this week so you can be successful? Um, I would like my husband to know because I want him to kind of cheer me on since it is a lot about him. When you look at this combined and mm -hmm. everything we've talked about, what is your confidence level that you can actually get this done? 100%. I can 100%. Do this. Yes. You're going to do this. Yes. Steve, we'll see you back in the studio. Now, Jacqueline, how's it been since Greg left your home? Were you able to make time for your husband, put aside the non-essentials in your life? Well, first, I wanted to thank Greg for coming to my house. He helped me reprioritize all the things I had on my plate and move some things that were maybe at the bottom to the top of my list. I put my Etsy shop on vacation mode. I didn't close it completely. But by doing that, I was able to go on a date with my husband this week. So. I want you to get the book and really read it. Because I can't even tell you how much it helped me. Okay. I think you're going to be fine. I think you'll get it right. Thank you very much, Thank okay? You. And a special thanks to my buddy Greg McEwen. Uh, folks, we want everyone to reach their full potential. That's why all of you are going home with a copy of Greg's book, Essentialism, The Disciplined Pursuit of Less. We'll be right back. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're gonna enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.